Hi guys, today I'll be showing you how to copy a DVD to your Windows computer using an app called Video Proc Converter AI. Right here. This is the look of the app. So why do we need to copy contents from a DVD to your computer? There are a few main reasons to do this. First of all, in terms of durability, a physical DVD won't last long. After several years, it will deteriorate to a point where a DVD player cannot read it properly, resulting in an error DVD or an unusable DVD. Second, DVDs are outdated these days because people prefer a quick and convenient way to access their videos. If it is a personal DVD about a family trip or a wedding ceremony, people prefer to store it on their external hard drives or a computer because it is much quicker to access and safer to store than a traditional DVD. Third, storing a DVD content in a computer would last much, much longer than on a physical DVD. So if you have lots of old DVDs that need converting and copying to a computer or a safer place, apps like Video Proc Converter AI is highly recommended for you because it can help you copy your DVDs to your computers quickly and effectively. So let me demonstrate how this app works. So you can see there are a lot of features right here, but our main focus is only on DVD copy. So we click on DVD here, and at the top you can see there are different options. You can convert directly from a DVD disc, from a DVD folder, or from ISO file. So in this tutorial, I'm planning to show you how to copy directly from a DVD drive. So we click on DVD disc and it automatically recognize my DVD. So I click on done. Now it adds in. This is my DVD. There are seven chapters in here. I just let it tick all of them because I want it to be combined into one single video file. Next is you need to click on target format. So you can see here there are different options for you to choose. We have general profiles. This one provide recommended formats for you. For example, MP4, MOV for iPhone, iPad, Android, HEVC, MP4, WEBM video. And if you only want to copy the whole DVD as a DVD itself or as an image file, these are the options for you. You can select DVD backup. They have full title copies, which include backup title, audio, video, subtitle, or main movie content copy. If you want to clone it into ISO file, this is the one, or turn it into MKV. And a lot more options down here for Apple device, Huawei, Samsung, Android, Pad, Android Mobile, Microsoft device, Sony device, for YouTube video, Facebook video, Vimeo, and even for DVD profile like NTSC DVD format or PAL DVD format. You can even convert it to 4K, HD video, TV video, and music. But the one I want to show you today is copying your DVD and converting them into MP4 videos. So I will select general profiles and click on the recommended mp4 video with h264 codec that is the standard mp3 file format so i just click on that click on done now if you want to customize your mp4 format you can also do so by clicking on this icon here the setting icon if you take a look at the top left, it starts with quality. If you want it to convert fast, you can do so as well, but the quality is low. If you want it to convert with high quality video, you have to select slow, which means it will take more time to convert. But in my situation, I just click to select default. And down here, we have video codec options. You have video codecs, frame rate. You can keep original or you can select the ones you want. Resolution, the same. If you want to keep the original resolution, you can do so as well or you can just click on custom here to change the video resolution or just click to select one of the options let's say in my case i would choose hd video 1920 by 1080 and everything else i would keep it the same and once everything is done i click on done here Next is, you will take a look at the chapter this DVD has. It has seven chapters. I select all of it to merge them into one video, you can see here. So this is automatically select for you. If you don't want them to merge, you can also untick this. But in my case, I would merge them into one video file. And if you want to rename your converted video, you can do so as well by clicking on rename here and then rename it to the way you want. And because this video is about animal, I just put animals. This one, animals. 
if you want to add artwork to it you can do so as well but in my case i just leave it like that click on done and if you take a look at this side here we have hardware acceleration engine if you have compatible hardware that can help boost the conversion process to be faster you can do so as well by clicking on option here and if you take a look at my case here is a hardware info detected by video prop converter ai in this case it does not detect any hardware acceleration engine intel or nvidia or amd that's why they say none but if you have like if you're running windows computer with nvidia or intel processor it will be able to detect that and help you to convert faster so in my case i don't have so i just click on ok and the cpu core here so if you're using mac computer it will have more core to use or if you're using the latest windows computer also you may have advanced cpu core with like 16 or 8 cpu core you can select it from here but in my case only two so i leave it like that by default you can also select the output where you want this to save but if you want to change just click on browse and i select on desktop click on select so it will save on my desktop so if everything is checked out you can start the conversion process by clicking on run here so the process will start you just have to wait for it okay now the process is done you can see that it shows me the converted file so the file size is 2.9 gigabytes if you want it smaller you can select 720p but because i selected the hd version which is 1920 by 1080 that's why the file size is kind of big let's see this video what it looks like after the conversion So you can see here it's in HD so it's beautiful because I'm using screen recording that's why you don't hear the sound and also to avoid copyright the original song has been muted that's why you don't hear any sound but I can guarantee you that the sound and the video quality is great as you can see right here again this is just for demonstration purposes only you can see how it works converting using video proc converter it works perfectly the video so you can see how effective video proc converter is and if you're interested in the app all the links are in the description you can check them out I would recommend you to try the trial versions first see how it works and if you think it's best suited your need you can purchase it genuinely from its website from the link in the description if you take a look at the main page here it should be noted that you don't just use video prop converter to convert your dvd or copy your dvd to your computer there are a number of other features that this app provides as well for example like you can convert the video that you have into various video formats by selecting video converter here or you can even record screen and most importantly right now video prop converter has added ai feature which includes super resolution with this feature you can upscale your low quality videos like 720p to hd video or 4k video they have also the options frame interpolation and stabilization feature so these are new features that this app also provides all in one package so if you're interested in the app again all the links are in the description you can check it out okay that's it guys this is video prop converter ai one of the best windows and mac application that you can use to copy or convert your dvd to your computer effectively thank you so much for watching if you like the video please give us a thumbs up comment down below and subscribe for more useful videos in the future have a great day guys see you in the next video